Okay, hi guys. I'm going real quick um, for fourth hour. Uh, you'll uh, read your updates. Hi guys. Um, fourth hour here, so it is Friday, 10:30 a.m. Sorry, I, I'm unable to be here today um, because I have a doctor's appointment that I take my wife to. Um, that uh, 15 years ago, she is a cancer survivor, and always I'm honest and tell you guys she's doing fine. But it's just a standard uh, testing day and whatnot, and she needs somebody to take her there because they do blood work and all that kind of stuff. So uh, you guys are on your own today, all right? Couple things, okay? Uh, we've had some little glitches with some stuff, and whatnot. One thing I ask is when we're back live teaching, we are not going to do any chat rooms anymore because. When I'm talking with you, it's too hard for me to see. And what I need for you guys to do is just under your mic. It's the same way as like raising your hand in class and you'll raise your hand in class, you know, say, Mr. Brown, I got a question. Because honestly, I can't tell who it is. You just talk and then you shut your mic back off. I answer, whatever like that, so everybody can hear. So we're gonna do that from now on when I'm back in the class live and not a recording uh, starting next Tuesday, okay? All right, so if you look up here, here are answers September 24th, that's, uh, I'm sorry, September 24th, so tomorrow, September 20th, tomorrow, September 24th, yeah, I'm sorry, September 25th. So I'll change this to September 25th here in two seconds here, so you'll see September 25th on yours, even though I'm pointing and I have September 24th. All right, so first things first, I asked you to try those worksheet, those workbook problems. Well, I changed a little bit because there were some difficult ones, so all you actually had to do was do on page one, Try problems one to three and page five, one to three. I did the workout for you and you just can check your answers. There's no assignment there for you other than just check them. Hopefully you tried them. You know, I don't know if you did, um, but if well, I was here in class, I would be going over these for you if you did and watching, okay? So you can check those answers on those. Just six problems I asked for you to try, please. Then we have nothing but review. We need more practice because it's important on sig figs. Uh, rounding sig figs and all that stuff. So you have four practice worksheets, okay? All of them I put on there, not till next Wednesday. Today is Friday. So you got this time in class when you're done watching this. You got Saturday, you got Sunday, you got Monday, you got Tuesday back in class with me and they're not due till Wednesday on a work day. So there's plenty of time for these and you have all the videos that we've already went over with all this stuff, rules, and I went over all the answers before. They're just more practice. We have to practice. These are gonna be homework assignments, so we'll get a homework grade on them too when they're submitted finally on Wednesday. So you have right here, worksheet E, which is practicing sig figs and scientific notation again. Same stuff we did in class uh, that I went over from the other worksheet, like stuff. Uh, it says due Wednesday, September 30, long ways away. Then we have some more practice on scientific notation. I give you some great, please complete the following homework grade. For homework grade, practice scientific notation. Then we got some simple conversions. Now on this simple conversions, I threw you a curveball. They are feet to meters and things like that, but I put the little conversions. If you notice, I even said right up at the top, it tells you on, on the worksheet, what they're converting to. So you'll do a simple five-step method, no problem, but I just need you to think in those parameters. Because remember, anytime we have a conversion, I'm always going to give you the uh, conversion of the system if it's not metric. So you can practice that. But you'll see me before they're due on Wednesday. But you guys should be able, if you use the five-step method, okay, have no problem doing it. And the last but not least is another worksheet here which was sig figs with scientific notation to as well. More practice for homework grade on these topics. Please give me worksheet problems below. So there's a little double dip here on this, but they're all good practice because we're getting close to having a little quiz sometime next week over these things, short and to the point. So the more practice we can do, one time doing it in class amigo is not enough, so we just need to practice it more. The good thing is you have all these videos explaining all this stuff, again, that you can look back over all the rules, whether it be sig figs, rounding, rounding stuff, uh, scientific notation, or conversions five step, okay? And even the lectures and the PowerPoints if you need them, all right? So that's what you'll be doing uh, when you're done here watching this, giving you directions on that. Uh, Miss King will probably be uh, somewhere close by too if you need to reach out to her as well. 
But um, if there's any problems, email me, okay? Uh, but have a great rest of your weekend. This is what I'll need to, and I won't see you again until Tuesday. Be safe. Uh, make sure that um, if you have any questions, let me know, okay? So I'm going to stop the video, upload this. This will be the first thing you see right here above the answer sheet, September 25th. Watch the video first, and then these things follow underneath it. Answers and four homework assignments, okay? All right. Be good. Have a good, safe weekend. Watch out for bears.